Hello everyone, I'm Konkana Bakshi, the Principal Image Consultant and the founder of Savafair Academy, the luxury finishing school in Mumbai and Treshik which provides image consultancy services. Today we will talk about how to analyze your body and understand your own body shape and how to dress to flutter your body proportion. To determine your body silhouette, simply stand in front of a full length mirror wearing an all black body hugging attire. You can also wear all white, just make sure you use same color top and bottom. Observe your overall body shape. Focus on the shape of your torso which is from your shoulder to hips. How do your shoulder compare to your waistline and your hips? Is your weight equally distributed? You can take a picture of your full body from the front and the side and then draw with a pen the outline of your body on the picture. Alternatively, if you have difficulty visualizing your body's contour, take measurements using a measuring tape and use those to determine which areas of your body are the widest and the thinnest. Start with your shoulder and bust, which will help you determine how large your upper body is. Stand in front of a full length mirror with your back straight and your shoulder relaxed. Extend the tape measure from the outer edge of one shoulder to the outer edge of the other. Keep the tape parallel to the floor. Look at the number in the mirror and carefully bend your head to look at it without changing your posture. Mark the number down with pencil and paper. Stand in front of a full length mirror. Wrap the measure tape around the fullest part of your chest. Keep the tape parallel to the floor. Stick a thumb beneath the tape to prevent yourself from pulling it too tight. Bring the ends of the tape together in the center front of your body. Look in the mirror to read the number of your inches or carefully look down at the number without moving the tape measure or adjusting your posture. This is the second of your basic measurements and often helps in determining how wide your midsection is. Stand in front of a full length mirror. Find the narrowest part of your waist known as the natural waist. Slowly bend to your right or left without looking in the mirror. The area where your side creases as you bend usually located directly beneath your rib cage is the point to place the tape measure. Wrap the measure tape around your natural waist. Keep the tape parallel to the floor. Do not suck in or hold your breath. Keep your back and stomach relaxed. Stick a thumb beneath the tape measure to prevent yourself from pulling it too tight. Bring the tape together in your center front. Read the measurement by looking at the number in the mirror or by carefully tilting your head down without changing your posture. Your hip measurement is the fourth and final basic you need. Knowing your hip measurement helps you determining how large or small your low body is. Stand in front of a full length mirror with your feet close together. Wrap the measure tape around the widest part of your hips. This is usually the area where your hip bones are located. Keep the tape measure parallel to the floor. Stick your thumb beneath the tape to prevent yourself from pulling it too tight. Bring the ends of the tape together in front of you. Read the measurements in the mirror or look down at the number without losing your grip. Now when you have all your measurements ready, follow these guidelines to determine your body shape. If your shoulders are wider than your waistline and hip line, you are an inverted triangle. Similarly, if your hips are wider than your shoulder and waistline, you are a triangle or a pear shape. If your hips and shoulders are the same or similar width and waistline is relatively smaller, you are an hourglass. If your hips and shoulders are fairly proportioned, you have a rounded tummy and you put on weight proportionately, you are a figure eight. If your shoulder is comparatively smaller and your legs are thinner, yet you think you have a slightly rounded tummy, then you have an oval shaped body, often known as apple shape. Every body type is beautiful, whichever category you fall under. Just take a look in the mirror and see what you love about yourself. 
you might have shapely legs as an oval body, a tiny waist as an hourglass, athletic shoulder as a rectangle or inverted triangle. Enhance your favorite part of your body through dressing. Stay tuned for our next video where we will further discuss about styling for your body shape. Until then, stay tuned, stay glamorous.